I'm Paul Stacey, Associate Director for Global Learning with Creative Commons. Creative Commons is headquartered in Silicon Valley, but I work out of Vancouver in British Columbia. Well, so I think with Creative Commons licenses, what we're seeing is people are applying those licenses to education content, be it courseware or textbooks or supplementary materials so that the entire spectrum of resources that a faculty member might use to teach with become openly licensed. Um, we're seeing that spread now into research, so we're also seeing Creative Commons licenses be used for publishing research articles, which again broadens the spectrum of use and makes even more resources available to not just teachers and students, but the public in general. But the area where I'm really starting to get excited is around what I might call open practices, where we're, we're beginning to think about what are the potential teaching and learning practices that we could utilize because these resources are open, that we wouldn't have been able to do if they were proprietary. Um, well, I, I guess, the, so a, a couple of quick answers there. I think that there's not necessarily a, um, a battle between for-profits and not-for-profits. I think that both for-profits and non-profits can make use of Creative Commons licenses and be participants in the open education space. They're not mutually exclusive. I think that there are many people who make use of Creative Commons licenses and do so in a way that generates remuneration or revenue. But it does require typically a different business model, a different kind of uh, conceptual model for how you want to do whatever your practice is, whether it be education or publishing or music or galleries, museums, all of them are making use of Creative Commons licenses, but they're having, having to rethink how they go about providing their service. I think the OERU is the only initiative I can see right now that is implementing openness on such a broad basis. And it's also the only initiative that I think is implementing a method of practice and development that engages institutions around the globe and is, is pursuing a mission of, a philanthropic mission of providing free education to students everywhere. It's really a unique mission.